uh, seems that even with your partnership and uh, acquisition and merger with uh, VMware, you're sort of once ahead, once again ahead of the market. You know, since that that deal was struck, there's been numerous, you know, consolidation that's gone on in the cloud space. Yes. And of course, you've seen IBM announce the acquisition of Red Hat. So what do you think is happening now from an industry standpoint? Yeah, I think, um, I actually think that the move uh, that was made here in terms of VMware acquiring uh, Cloud Health was a catalyst of a series of changes that occurred in the market. And it's not that uh, companies weren't looking at these changes before. If you look, there were there's at least uh, uh, a half a dozen or more major changes that have occurred since that announcement. And I think what's happened is it's um, starting to realign the industry, which is, I think people realize that, you know, VMware has been the dominant provider of IT infrastructure in the world. Um, uh, VMware plus Cloud Health makes a very strong statement in terms of what management will look like for the next decade uh, and beyond. And so I think there's this realignment that's occurring, and I think there's in the, the acceleration, I think, is driven by the sense of urgency that now is the time to actually um, make a play and be relevant for uh, managing business services and applications into the future. So Cloud Health is obviously going to be the centerpiece of the public cloud strategy for VMware. They already have other public cloud uh, assets. How do those fit into the whole platform value proposition? Sure. So, uh, so if you look, they have both uh, assets that they have been organically building. Mm -hmm. um, uh, so, you, you know, uh, over the last couple of years, they've been um, uh, they they launched a cost uh, management product. They have a series of products in the public cloud. They also have uh, inorganic acquisitions that they've done. Uh, so, uh, you have Wavefront as an example. Um, so, so today, I think there's this portfolio of. Uh, products they built, products they acquired. Um, for us, they're all uh, part of uh, this better together story, which is what our customers are looking for, is they're looking for a single platform that can help them from the point of uh, designing a business service that's going to go into a target environment that could be public or hybrid, um, all the way through to deployment and then through the management and operations of those business services. And there, you know, if, if you look at that span, there's a variety of different um, products and tools that you need to support that, that journey. Uh, our philosophy as VMware and Cloud Health is that there's certain areas of that, um, uh, that management uh, plane that we're going to own and deliver for our customers. And then there's a large number of areas where we're going to look to an ecosystem and uh, have you know, uh, uh, the best of breed vendors that are providing uh, value to our customers. And so I think that's our strategy. I think the different um, uh, core products inside VMware fit as part of that overall management plane. Mm. And then some of them are actually um, uh, options that customers can choose Wavefront or they might choose uh, another product, like uh, they could choose Datadog or New Relic. Uh, and then there's, there's areas that we absolutely will uh, own uh, from a management perspective.